Barbara Bell says she is heartbroken because she planned to spend Thanksgiving surrounded by family in her home. But when a massive fire broke out several days ago, her plans had to change. They make me feel sad because we had already planned it. I had went shopping and to get the you know things that I want to cook and it's all gone. It's I don't know it was it was it's all gone. It's, it's got all burnt away. For 20 years, Barbara called this house her home. It was like paradise, I would like to say. Uh, I loved it. She shared it with her son, her grandchild, and her great-grandchildren. But on November 18th, a fire destroyed their home and displaced all seven of them. See, like, this is all I had and all I ever owned it. And I lost so much. Barbara's granddaughter, Adasha Hannah, had to move into her cousin's house with her two sons, one who has cerebral palsy. So it's nine kids, told, nine people total in a three bedroom house. Adasha recently started a GoFundMe in hopes of getting back to the life they once knew. Well, my kids want a home. They're not used to sleeping in someone else's house because we don't have a home of our own. And although the fire took everything from them, Barbara says at least she still has what matters most. Something lost, but I still have my family. I still have my family, and I'm thankful for that. For more information on the GoFundMe, you can head to our website at WPBF.com. Anna Espinosa, WPBF 25 News.